Hello. Uh, my my hair is kind of weird. <laughs> Hi. Your baby danger. <laughs> you are my fan, right? <laughs> Long time no see you guys. Hallelujah. <laughs> it was okay? Really? It's not, it's not weird, it's not weird, you know, it's comfortable, it's comfortable. <laughs> oh, funny. Do you guys like this? <laughs> I'm weird. Let out, who is that? <laughs> you know what? If you guys are um, talking bad word, I don't want to bad any energy. You can get out here, okay? So somebody who love me and then love my teaching and love my prayer, remain here. But if you if you don't interest in, if you want to release bad word, I don't want to take any negative energy from you guys. And then you can get out, okay? Please. Or you can just pr uh, delete it. I'm allowing you can delete it for those people, you know. <clears throat> anyway, hello. My uh, sister's brothers and, and, and the world, and, and I just want to pray and pray. And because it's so many people every day, who is there? Can go best. All right, thank you. I love you too. Yeah, so um, <clears throat> yeah, I have not seen you very long time, huh? I know I'm just crazy busy uh, since I've started the healing room, local healing room, and Dubai and Uganda, it just, just overwhelm, you know. Even today, so many people ask me prayers through um, Facebook message. And I wish I can pray all people who are asking. But, you know, I, I can't. If, if I have to, if I pray for those all the privately, I can't work. I'm just all day long and sitting here and I have to pray. Uh, please forgive me, okay? And, uh, um, I would, you know, if you have faith, it's work also. It's all pray like here, you know, because it's the Holy Spirit will touch you. I'm not healing healer. I'm not healer. Only Jesus, you know. I'm just here and make agreement with him and standing with you, you know, encouragement so that you can, you know, see your healing, your own healing by your faith, you know. Okay. So I just want to talk we can depend. Yes, yes. You know, Holy Spirit inside of you. You can depend on the Holy Spirit. You can depend on Jesus, not me. You know, I'm just here encouraging and activating and initiating your faith. You know, that's the, my function. I'm not the healer. You got to remember this. So anyway, you, I don't know you guys how much you know the quantum physics. Oh my goodness. Last night, my husband major 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 breakthrough last night uh, uh according to this uh, quantum physics uh principle and then his major like inner healing just took place um because in, according to quantum physics this uh, uh present time uh control this uh past so you know we in past we have a lot uh emotional problem you know all the trauma and then now in present can control that past. That's the quantum physics theory. If you go to the, some Google or YouTube, you can study. And my husband will teach this in a very easy way. I cannot teach this because I, I'm not a scientist. I hard to understand. But my husband totally understand. So when, when my husband yesterday breaks through and how they possibly you applied your inner healing, which happened past, how that possibly healed in this present time. So he told me because the, I applied the quantum physics to my inner healing. And, uh, oh, then can you explain? And just he explained all things that I hard to understand. I'm not a brain woman. So he's researching now, making, simplified how, so that he can teach, uh, you know, to the people who cannot understand the scientific way, okay? So that's my husband is working on that. So you can literally wait. Um, he's working on that. Also, he doesn't want to just teach it theory. He wants to... Um, 
uh, you know, it's, you know, he wants to teach you how to, not only theory, how to apply to your life this awesome theory. So that, that's the, he's working on that. It sounds good? Yeah. So, but for me, it's uh, one thing so I, I apply this quantum physics to my life or so this, uh, you know, uh, conducting all the miracle wonder sign and healing. And this is what I'm doing. I, I think you guys watched already my uh, uh, Facebook, this video, I, when I taught a little bit last time, last week, you know, the, the, the Salem healing room. So, you know, in the quantum physics, you know, we all everything. You are like, you are like existing as the wave, vibration, energy, right? I am the also. All things, it looks solid. All the existing as the energy. Yes, hi. So, so, <clears throat> it's just everything you, it, if you just apply it to the Bible, we are, we are living in this spiritual realm. Spiritual realm is, is, looks like we cannot see, but this is real. So like faith, we can see this spiritual realm by faith, because faith is substance. The Hebrew said, faith is substance of the things you have not seen, you hoped for, the conviction of, of the things you have not seen, right? So it's, it's quantum physics. We cannot see in our physical eyes because it's so teeny, 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 you know, particle. And then it's existing it's wave, but when they begin to observing this wave of vibration turn to the particle. So it's, it's they're like, they're, they're still, they couldn't figure out how the possible. You know, existing as the wave, but when they observe it, this turn to the particle, this wave. So the, I think this is perfectly we fit to our Bible principle. You know, we, everything is existing in the in the heaven. All things God just given to us, all the inheritance to the His children, but we cannot see. Where is that inheritance? Where is that blessing? Where is the abundance? The Bible said God is abundance. He is in the heaven. There are all the treasure, abundance, all things. We can, we can get it. But how we get it? How we get it, that abundance? The healing, God said, by my stripe, Jesus said, my stripe, it's done deal. It's you were healed. He didn't say you will be healed. But we, in the, this uh, uh, classic Fiji, we only see this pain. Hmm? Problem. But the Bible said, you are healed. How this make, uh, or how this make, bring the like reality world in this world? So Bible said only face. All know, you guys know. But this quantum, according to this quantum physics, this is not just religious, some requirement, some theory. This is perfectly scientific. Because the scientist said everything existing, so many, all the existing is as the wave. We cannot see. But when we begin to observing this turning into the particle, something, something we can see. You, you understand what I mean? And that's so amazing. Just like that, like, like healing. For example, you are now, you are now like really suffering all the problem. I have a little, this teeth problem right now. So I want to pray with you guys together. I only feel this, this pain. I have root came out. That's why I have pain. I, I feel not good here. But in the quantum physics, when we, in the quantum physics, when we see this, it's, it's healing, it's pain gone by faith. Focusing. It's pain gone. And then we speak. We speak. Speaking is sound. Sound is energy. Energy is shapes of matter. Right? Just like microwave. Energy always changes the matter shape. Something happened when the energy happened. Okay. 
A lot of scientists say uh, when you speak a blessing, some like plant more, more growing so well, some cursing plant is die and rice, you know, when we speak, uh, you know, blessing, the rice is... Oh, you, you guys know all the story, scientific story, you know? It's real. Our speaking is so powerful already without even Holy Spirit because the, 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 the God designed, you know, that way we, we, because He designed us according to His likeness, His, His image. So He's speaking powerful. So we are also powerful. But think about when you speak with Oneness, one mingling Holy Spirit, not only your spirit, because the Bible said he who joined to the Lord is one spirit. So when you speak to the, this pain now, hmm? not just speaking, like pain go, not only your spirit, you're speaking with one spirit with the Holy Spirit. Huh? This Holy Spirit, it's not just spirit. It's, 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 you cannot even imagine. This universe, actually made by this Holy Spirit, this power of the Holy Spirit. Jesus resurrected this by power of the Holy Spirit. It's Holy Spirit is gentle, comfort, but this so powerful. So powerful. You, we cannot even imagine. Then, you think about when you speak with your mouth or powerful tongue in His Holy Spirit. Your spirit mingled with the Holy Spirit. You think about how much powerful the spirit. The spirit is energy. So you speak to your pain, your problem, your circumstance, your finance, your relationship. Something change. We can change something shape. Just like microwave, the, by energy, something change. Some shape, shape change. You, you get it, this? Oof, I'm already feel power. Wow. Somebody have a metabolism system so blocked and the left side the knee problem and God is touching. I actually both, but somebody left side more worse, but actually I feel both of this, uh, the, this knee. Wow, brain problem. Hear a lot of people from brain problem. Brain. God is touching you right now. Woo! Woo! Left shoulder. Left shoulder is just really misaligning and discomfort. Woo! Now it's somebody migraine is left. Woo! Wow, it's powerful. Wow, I just feel so power when I'm speaking this. So, you know what? We speak together. You speak to yourself and speak to your friend with one spirit, this most powerful Holy Spirit. And you speak. And this faith is energy. That's why even Hindu, I'm not talking about this New Age stuff, but you know, when you watch some YouTube, some Hindu girl, she's a Hindu girl, like 10 years old girl. She just the, the spoon. She think this can bending over. So she just, she concentrate. She totally 100% believe. You know what? When you believe it, energy coming out. Because faith is energy. And he touching like a spoon. And then it's bent over. So easily. I saw that. And there are lots like supernatural things in the different religion or just different world, you know? How come they can do that? They, they, they doing just by some evil spirit? Well, I don't think so. God made us such a powerful. Already we have a potential power. But those, some, those specific people, they understand. They know. By some, their own teaching, whatever. They found how they are powerful through their different religion, different teaching. You know? They know. They know how they are powerful. Hmm? But we have such a most powerful Holy Spirit. And if we can't break through this 